Okay, this is going to be a quick video on the use of autopilot and healthy drones using autopilot's black box capability to export data out and import it back into healthy drones. If you haven't already, I recommend going to healthy drones and creating your own account. Uh, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go into iTunes, um, connect up your iOS device, and you should see autopilot under the list of apps. Under Autopilot, you should see a folder called Flight Recorder. If you take that folder and you drag and drop it over onto uh, a, uh, a window, a finder window, you can open it up. And this is where it's really nice. It'll list all of your, your last flights. And if you look at it, inside of each one of them, there is a data.zip file. Um, what I can do instead of having to select each one is I can actually so I'll just select all of these. I'm going to go back to uh, Healthy Drones. I'm going to click on Upload. Um, the currently you have to upload things manually with Autopilot. The uh, automatic uploading directly from Autopilot is coming. But right now you have to go through this process. But I'm going to take this. I'm going to drag and drop it over does a nice job of automatically finding them. I think some of these are too small, so they might not work, but most of them should. So if I click on uh, Upload, once you've finished uploading, you can see the list of the recent files that I just created. I can click on them, and it provides some nice information on the flight. In addition, obviously, the path that I took for the last these last couple of flights. Um, it, I can also go in and see power information, how long I'm getting out of my battery, more information on the battery cells, more information you know, on the battery info. Um, I can also go in and see information on the, the sensors. So this is every move that I've made with my joysticks as I was flying around. It's good information on the controls. And I think even the uh, the wind, this is kind of cool too, it kind of showed the average wind direction. Um, so I'm just, I actually just got this and just started playing with it today. And uh, I think it's pretty interesting, so I thought I'd share it out with you guys. One other thing I wanted to show that I thought was kind of nice out of the, uh, the Healthy Drones capability was like you click on share. It'll list all the information that you want to share. In this case, I don't think I have any pictures to share on this particular one. Um, it'll create a unique sharing link. I can take that link and now that link is available to be shared and people can look at it. Right, pretty good stuff.